In this tutorial, we will demonstrate how to set up your employer details. On the Open Company screen, simply click the option to set up new employer. Before getting started, BrightPay will need a few details about the employer. For example, its name, address and PAYE registration details. Click Next to continue. On the screen, you are asked how you would like to use BrightPay. Once you have selected the option most relevant, click Next to continue. Enter your employer name and address. Click Next to continue. Under Tax and PYE, enter your tax district, employer PYE reference and accounts office reference. The employer PYE reference must consist of a three-digit office number as well as a valid reference number. If you qualify for Small Employers Relief, tick the box provided. Should the Scottish Variable Rate apply, simply tick this box. A payroll given reference can also be entered on this screen, if applicable. Click Next to continue. Should you wish to organise your employees into departments, simply enter the departmental names you require in this screen. These departments can subsequently be used in your payroll processing and analysis. More departments can be added at a later date if needed. Alternatively, if you wish to skip this step, simply click on Next. In this screen, you are now asked about your typical employee. These settings will be used as the default when adding a new employee, but can be changed on an individual basis if required. Firstly, select the desired default pay frequency from the drop-down menu. Secondly, select the typical pay method. Either a set amount each period, a daily rate or based on hours worked. Finally, select the typical working days that your company operates. Click Next to continue. To protect your payroll information, a password must be set and will be required to open the employer data file in future. Enter a password of your choice and re-enter to confirm this. Click Save and Finish. The final step is to choose a location to save your employer file to. Employer files should always be kept away from the BrightPay installation folder. For example, by saving them to a separate folder created on your local C drive. Multiple users of BrightPay who wish to share employer files across the network should ensure that this folder is created on the network so that employer files can be saved here for shared access. The software itself, however, must be installed and run locally on each individual PC. When ready, click on Save. Your employee details have now been added.